guys, I am here with my friend Roxy today. Hi. We're going to do a get ready for me at the pool. So if you have a pool party to go to with your friends or family, we are both going to show you what we tend to do if we're going to one. So make sure you go over to Roxy's channel and see her video as well. And let's get started. Yes. So starting with my face, I'm going to use a BB cream because it is super lightweight, but it'll still even on my skin tone. And this shade is a little bit light for me, so I'm mixing in my Basha Bronze BB Cream with it. Now, I have to use something in my brows because as you can tell, they are, you know, pretty light. So I'm using this pencil by Hourglass, and it is a wax. So it's really perfect for if you're going outside, like to the pool, to the beach, wherever, because the wax really clings to your hairs. And then this is optional. You can always add a brow powder to give yourself a little bit more definition. And then make sure to brush through your eyebrows so it looks very natural. Next, I'm taking some concealer onto this little blemish down here and also underneath my eyes to get rid of any darkness and on my eyelids to cancel out any redness or veins. And I always like to blend in my concealer with a brush because it gives you the most natural finish. Next, I'm taking some bronzer to warm up my face and give me some life. So I'm applying this like I would if I were contouring, but I'm using a much bigger brush. So it's going to look way more natural. So I'm putting this just basically all around my face, up towards my temples, my cheeks, and then don't forget to bring that down onto your neck and your chest to really even it out. Make sure you put your sunscreen on before you do this because if it defeats a purpose if you put your sunscreen on after, it's like not good. Now for mascara, I'm using waterproof mascara, the voluminous on the bottom because it's very thickening and then I'm putting on the, what is it called, shocking extensions on top and this totally lengthens your your lashes. Now if I'm like really swimming, if I am at the lake and I'm going to like be swimming and stuff, I don't use mascara because it gets out of control. Um, but like if I'm going to a pool party and I'm not going to really be like underwater, then I'll put on mascara. And I also am going to put some liner just on my lower waterline and right in that inner corner to define my eyes. And for lips, I'm using this Tata Harper lip, it's like a tinted lip balm. It's amazing, it's so hydrating, I love it. Moving on to hair. So first, I'm using some dry shampoo. So this hair, like my hair right now is a day old. I curled it the previous day. So I'm going to work with its natural wave and try not to do much to it. So use a dry shampoo to get rid of any oil. Make sure you get the back too and just really work that into your scalp. And then I'm adding just a few curls with my curling iron to kind of refresh my curls, but just the top layer. I'm not going to like totally fry my hair because I'm going to be going in the sun. So just a little bit to, you know, kind of finish off your look. I also just realized I applied some bronzer onto my lids with a big fluffy brush, but totally unnecessary. I just felt like doing it. And last, I'm spraying this hairspray in, not for the hold, but more for the protection. It's really good for UV protection, so I like to use this before I go outside. On to Roxy's details. So her hat is from Topshop. Her top is from Laura's Boutique, and I wish you could see the back because it's so cute. Her bag is Elizabeth and James, and I just love the blue leather for summer. 
Her skirt that she's wearing is Forever 21 and her sandals are Steve Madden. I love the studs. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure to head over to Roxy's video to see my details of my outfit. And I hope you guys all have a great summer.